Hello and welcome back. This is Tron at Homegrown Audio and today well we're gonna do something a bit a bit different. So have you ever wondered how your music would sound if you had at your disposal a million dollar studio or something like this? Uh, maybe you wake up at night just crying because you can't afford that piece of equipment that you really really want or you think you need. Well, I have a solution for you. Hello and welcome back. I'm going to show you a very different kind of plugin. If you are into analog gear, or you want to, but you can't afford the classic machines, you will love this. Before we start, hit the thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more content like this every week. Also, check my Patreon for all channel presets, exclusive sound banks, and much more. Okay, let me say it, Acoustica Audio, they are incredible. These plugins work in a very different way. They are emulated out of recordings from the original hardware kind of how a convolution reverb works. These virtual machines are modeled in such a close way to the originals, it is, for me, questionable and completely unnoticeable difference. Just so you know, if you enroll in my lecture this weekend, August 22 and 23 at Adapt Music Academy, or any lecture in this massive Psytrance workshop, you will get 50% discount on your next purchase with Acoustica Audio. So check out the links below for more info about the lectures and a direct link to Acoustica Audio sites also. Let's check a couple of the dynamic processors. This is called Aquamarine 4. It is both opto and discrete compressor. And it's modeled after a super popular hardware compressor that I want. Let's try the discrete side for now. If you want to see the basic compression tutorial, check the video here on the top right. Now I'll just add an LFO tool. This is so smooth, it is unbelievably nice, tuning it is a lot of fun and it's really responsive, like a real hardware unit, it sounds really amazing here. Now let's try the opto compressor.
Down here we have different preamps to match whichever flavor you need. This is just incredible control. It is the closest there is from actual real hardware. Now let's try another one. The only thing about these plugins is they are heavy on the processors. Look at this. With my poor little laptop, it's not the best computer, but yeah, they are heavy. If you have a decent desktop computer, it will be fine. You can run a bunch of instances. Now let's try another plugin. Let's try Titanium, which is a multiband compressor. Really outstanding sound, really, wow. This is the first time I'm trying these and I'm totally amazed by the control. It really feels like you're tweaking hardware right now. Okay, this is just unbelievably nice and true to the original. And the plus is it looks awesome. The graphic user interface is great. Now I'll compress the bottom end of our baseline. Let's move the crossover to 150 hertz. Any compressor will do what it says on the tin. It will compress. There is a huge difference from one purely digital compressor to a hardware emulation. They both have different applications, in my experience. Even if we try, it will be nearly impossible to get the same compression envelope. Any compressor will serve its purpose, but these Acoustica Audio emulations are so true to the real thing, and they have tons and tons and tons of classic machines that you can pick. You will love this place. They have so many channel strips, EQs and compressors. They even have a few that are for free, so you should go and check them out. For me, these are the absolute best emulations of hardware that you can find anywhere. 
You just need to install their software installer called Aquarius and browse around. Anyways, that is all for now. I hope you like the showcase. Remember, if you subscribe to my lecture this weekend at ADAPT, you will get also a 50% discount code for your next purchase at Acoustica Audio. Don't miss out on this great opportunity to learn and get some fancy schmancy new toys. Hit thumbs up if you like this and subscribe to the channel for more of this every week. Check the Patreon for presets, soundbanks and much more. Thank you for watching and see you next time.